Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. And today we're gonna to be looking at something called deepnest.io. So it allows you to nest your parts ready for CNC or laser or plasma cut. Also say any cutters that you've got like a paper cutter or if you're trying to produce a plan with all the parts that are close together to make it easier to cut and reduce waste. So this is an example of what the software can do. As you can see, we've got all the parts that have been laid out and this has come from an imported SVG file. So let's just run through how you would do this in this software. So this is the main screen. As you can see, we've got all the parts here and the space that we're gonna place the part in. I'm just gonna close this down and clear all that's selected. It's a very simple UI and it's very easy to navigate. First of all, we've got import our file. Now the files that are supported are the CAD formats of SVG, DXF and CDR. We've got some example files that come along with the software itself. So for instance, we have this chessboard SVG and let's open that up. As you can see, the SVG contains just these parts. We've got the parts on the left hand side, along with each of the sizes of them. On the left hand side you've got this cog that shows you all the details we need for changing the settings. When I say details, if we roll over any of these fields on the right hand side, we get information of how to use the setting and what it does. So for instance here I've got space between parts of 0.5 millimeters. It's a really easy UI to use. Let's go back to our input. First of all we need to select a sheet. So we've got this sheet here. The sheet is the part that all the other parts will be injected into. So let's click on the sheet. It'll be highlighted in blue and then select the sheet button. We can up the quantity if we want. Next, let's select all the parts that we want to place inside the sheet. We can unselect the parts if we want to. And then it's a very simple case of starting a nest. DeepNest will analyze the SVG or the DXF file and come up with best matches for the layouts, which you can choose from by selecting these bars here. At any time you can stop the nest, select the layout you want. Clicking on export, we can export to an SVG file or a DXF file, ready to import into your CAM software or your laser cut software, or import back to FreeCAD. I'm just going to save this as results.svg, which I already have here. And we can select the file type we want and hit save. Looking on the file system, we can look at the export file and we have it here. Let's try another project. Going back, we can close our project, hit the delete button to delete all that's selected, import, select which SVG we want, let's go for the draw bot, find the sheet, mark that as a sheet, select all, and hit start nest. Extremely quickly, our nests are found and we've got the choice of selecting the different ones from the list. We can stop the nest at any time. And here we can see the best one is being placed at the top. Export, choose the file. Always remember to specify file extension. And that's it, it's done. Simple as that, and we get our results. DeepNest can be downloaded from deepnest.io. It's fully open source and is available in Windows, Mac, and Linux. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon. If you like what you see and you want to donate to the channel, then you can do so via PayPal at paypal.com forward slash paypalme forward slash Darren B. E. Stone, or at Ko-Fi or Coffee via ko-fi.com forward slash M-A-N-G-Zero. I also run a Patreon where you can get early access and additional content.
and that's at patreon.com forward slash mango jelly solutions. Links can be found in the channel header, on the about page, or in the descriptions of these videos. I thank everybody that's donated so far. It really helps to keep the lights on so I can produce more content and also expand the channel. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing to these videos, and I hope to see you again in the next one.